when would you say you earned the bus title? Uh, most definitely I earned it in 93. 93. I earned my title in 93, although I was probably here all the time, but, it, but I got my, got my wings in 93. <laughs> Did you get into music when your mother started pumping out the tunes when you were very young? I got into music from when I first heard it in a room, I think. Your sister's also musical as well, isn't she, Rose? My she sings. sister's got a voice like an angel, yeah, and I love her a lot, and she's going to have it. But uh, next, some things that we're doing, yeah, she's good. At the moment, you hold a residency at Freedom of Baglias and Time and Envy. Where else can we see you? Uh, me, and, me and Chris Creed are starting our own night at um, Velvet Rooms in Chain Cross Road called The Syndicate. What's the idea behind that night? The idea really is just getting back to the roots of um, a nice little party. It's only 250 people. It's about getting a nice, a nice group of people in there and playing, playing some really good vibes, just, just vibing, rather, as opposed to having a big, big, massive scream up like air, as you can see, do you know what I mean? So how would you rate the UK garage scene at the moment? Well, have a look for yourself. Uh, it's like it's having it, it's having it all over the place and it's just exploding. Yeah. Do you think it's important then to have nights like yours that's quite small and keeps it quiet? Or? I think they're essential because they're, they're the places where you can educate more, break, break the, be the fresher tracks that might, might not be breakable now because of the commercial aspects with it. So to keep the underground vibe going, yeah, you need those clubs. What have you got on in the studio at the moment? Um, we've got, I've got a couple of projects going with my sister in Creed and me and Grant are starting so the next NNG thing so there's lots going on at the moment, I mean, there's lot, lots of it in at the moment. <laughs> Your tune went down well here tonight didn't it? It's out, it should be out, at, this is on so go and buy it because um, I want a top 10 track really. <laughs> well they have it more. <laughs> You're renowned for playing funky sets, how would you describe your music? I'd describe it as educated, funky, and danceable, really. Yeah. You like to interact with the crowd as well. I like dancing. I like moving. I like. I'm not. I, you know what I mean, I'm in. I'm in the set, and I'm in the groove, and I'm watching the crowd, and I'm. I'm yeah, I'm in it. Yeah, I like. I like create. I like watching the vibe. I like creating the vibe, and I like getting involved in the vibe. So yeah. What's the vibe like here at Sweet Harmony? Yeah, Sweet Harmony. It's Jeff, pick him up. You've seen it. It's massive, it's huge, it's like, it's, it's noisy, it's like a little pop concert, you know what I mean? It's like, it's all that, it's a Sunday night, normal Sunday we'll night. Come see you, haven't they? <laughs> and the rest of the guys as well, yeah. It's a pretty good lineup down there, yeah, it's pretty amazing. It's some good people there tonight, yeah. Now here you're doing the UK Garage Awards again this year, that you've already tried to do before. What changes have you made? What we're going to do this time is we're going to incorporate it with a concert, and we're going to call it UKG Concert, and um, get the, we're going to get a vote in underway in the next couple of weeks, really, and get the forms out there, and just make sure it's more organised and more tight, so that um, no one can criticise it, really. And, that, and this time it's coming from people within, not from outside, so I'm hoping that's going to be huge, yeah. Well, back in the day, you had residences at the Black and White Pass at the Gas Club, and the Legends. What are your fondest memories of that time? Having it. <laughs> <laughs>